Welcome back to my channel. I am back today with another video. And as y'all can tell by the title and of course the thumbnail, we have another week to do a review on y'all. So of course, let's just get into it. Um, this one right here, y'all. This is from Sensationnel. This one is called Butter Lace Unit Number 15, y'all. I think I have all of the butter units, y'all. I don't think I missed one that I can think of. So anyway, I'm highly interested in what this one is looking like. But first, before we even get too far in the video, y'all, I'd like to give a huge shout out to EbonyLine.com for sending me this unit to do a review on. Thank you very much. Y'all already know how I feel. Always highly, highly, highly appreciative. So yes, thank you. So let's get into what this one is all about. Before I move on, this one right here, I just did a review on it. If you are interested in the cute little Bob, y'all know it's Bob season two. Um, I will leave the link in the description box below for you to go ahead and check that out. And yes, let's get into butter number 15. second chances and i know that i'm not perfect and this probably sounds really selfish but i hate that i'm not with you i just wish that i could tell you that my this time is the truth i lost the trust i understand but do i have to be that man it's unthinkable but Make your mind tonight Pulling your hair, baby I feel you breathing on me On you You know that I'm a selfish lover When it's mine, I want it On track, mine for it For you I don't think I can let you go I don't think I can let you go Bet you love me I go, bet you love me before I go I don't think I can let you go I don't think I can let you go Bet you love me before I go Bet you love me before I go Tell me what you want Tell me what you need, baby Tell me about your dreams Tell me everything, yeah Do it Y'all, I have a lot to say about her. She is real, real pretty. I am definitely feeling Butter 15, period. So anyway, um, let's get into all the good things. I might have a con or two, which might be on the personal side of this unit, but um, a lot of good things, soft. She is really, really soft. I'm loving the way she is feeling. Y'all, she better be soft because she's super, super long. She reaches past my butt, y'all. I am 5'3", so if you like long hair, don't care, this one is definitely gonna be for you. The curl pattern is really, really pretty. I 
Really like it. Y'all see, I did not comb through this hair. I only ran my fingers lightly through it because obviously um, the curl pattern is pretty in my opinion. I didn't want to mess up the curl pattern. And of course, when you have a curly wavy type of unit, it could get a little bit bigger. So I don't, I like this density right here. So, which is another thing. The density is perfect in my opinion. It looks like it can be someone's real hair when it comes to density, not length. But yeah, I'm definitely loving the way she is looking concerning the density. As for the parting space, I am a fan of the parting space. It's nice and it's long and it's just enough. We don't have to worry about it being too tight. Once I put the powder in, I was thoroughly satisfied. Um, she is ear to ear, so that's definitely a plus. So just by me running my fingers through her, I didn't get tangled, so um, I can't say if she's gonna be a tangle. I'm pretty sure she is, y'all, because this hair is long, it's synthetic, and obviously, I mean, more than likely, yes. But um, as for now, I didn't get many tangles at all out of this unit. The texture of this one is, to me, a slight, light, yakky texture, so um, I think my people who like silky and who like yakky will be a fan of this one. This is a nice one in my opinion when it comes to the texture. The claim of pre plication I think they did a decent job on it. It, it ain't A1, but it'll get the job done. I don't think we have to go in and do any extra plucking if we don't want to, but if you are extra, go ahead, by all means, pluck away. I don't think so. I don't like to pluck hairlines, and I don't think it's absolutely 100%, you know, necessary. So as for my con, one con that I do have is the baby hairs was super thick, I'm y'all. I'm not here for the baby hairs to be that thick. So I did lay them down. I don't think it looked bad, but I feel like when you have too many baby hairs, you can't really lay them down as well as you would like because they just look too thick. Um, so you have to probably pluck them out. I didn't pluck them out, obviously. Y'all know I don't like plucking. But I think it, it's, it's okay, it's okay. It's workable. You can also just cut them off too because this wig, in my opinion, we don't necessarily need any baby hairs to make it look natural anyway. So yeah, this is this is good. Now personally, she's a bit too long in my opinion for me. I am 5'3", she's, she's past my butt y'all, like seriously. She's a bit too long for me, but um, y'all know I would wear her anyway. Y'all, I wear long short up to the nape of my neck. I'll wear everything, but I just wish she wasn't as long as she was. But other than that, I think this wig is really, really nice. I love the way she's feeling, she's soft. She's a goal for me if you like extra long hair. So let's talk about the price. As for the price, you can find this one on ebonyline.com for $37 and some change. And I don't know how much it costs for the other colors, y'all, I didn't even look, but definitely go ahead and check it out on their website. So in my opinion, y'all, I think she is definitely a go. I think this is super, super cute. I am loving more things about her than I don't like about her, y'all. So yeah, let me know what y'all think about this and y'all already heard my opinion. So yeah, let's continue the conversation in the comment section below. And of course, do not forget to like, comment, and of course, subscribe. And I will see y'all in my next video.